what is what is SARM mean? Sure. Right. What is it? And then let's get into LGD. Okay. Um, so a SARM is a selective androgen receptor modulator. Okay. Um, a lot and, of terminology. Right? Yeah, it is. So what that means is it's going to bind with high affinity to certain androgen type receptors and not all. It's very similar to a SERM, which most people are familiar with. So SARM is a newer concept. A SERM or an SERM would be something like Clomid or Tamoxifen Citrate. What is the um, or e no mean SERM? That would be a selective estrogen, estrogen receptor modulator. Okay. okay. So, uh, you know, people, um, it's it's used for breast cancer uh, patients. It's used for, for certain things and mm -hmm. kind of a dated therapy now, but still it's out there. In the bodybuilding world, it's very common for guys to take it to protect against gynecomastia or breast tissue overgrowth, right? If they're on certain compounds and things in conjunction with testosterone. So that's how a SERM operates. A SARM is, is, is very similar but specific to androgen receptors. Um, in the case of uh, ligandrol or LGD, um, this one will bind with really high affinity to muscle cell and bone, but it will not bind with high affinity and, and technically very poor, if at all, to the prostate. So those males that tend to have a BPH type symptom or their prostate might flare up when they're on TRT or androgens as yeah. a whole, um, something like LGD is an alternative form that won't cause potentially any of the BPH symptoms, really? but it will increase muscle size and it will help with bone reformation. 